Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel, it's Earthan and in this video I'm just going to show you how to I'll show you guys how to create Alice in Doubt. So she's a very tricky one to create but um, you have to examine how she looks like, watch videos of her, look at her symmetry on her face and then find the, the perfect face that matches her. So I believe in my opinion that number three was the perfect one to use. Um, why? Simply because of the facial features again, the lips, the nose, the eyes, and uh, for that reason I've chosen number three. Skin tone I've chosen number one, you can however go for possibly number three. A lot more attractive, um, looks a lot better, so it's debated. Pink, pinkish or go for that one. I think I'm going to stick for this one. So age 21, athletic build, eye colour, I can't remember what colour her eyes are, I can't really tell. I'm going to go for probably light brown, light brown, yeah. But I'm not sure what colour her eyes are guys, so it's for you guys to look around on Google or whatever and have a look and uh, find that out. I've, I've looked on Google myself and the videos, um, I can't really tell. But I'll just stick with the light brown. Eyebrows obviously shaped. Um, carefree eyebrows. Go on that and then just go down towards narrow and low. Brow depth in the middle, um, just the neutral. Um, eye socket up, deep. Eye position towards outwards and slightly upwards. You know what guys? The, the blonde hair and the brown eyes look really good together gotta say. Um, nose turned up, down towards low and narrow, no, nose shape slightly upwards, nose tip wide and slightly upwards. Mouth and lips full, so mouth towards wide and low, mouth position slightly towards down, upwards, lip towards um, thick and towards wide. Lower lip again, same, same, but let's put that wide as well. Same as the lower lip. Okay, that's better. You know what, guys? I think you can make the lips a bit thicker as well. Why not? Let's put it on there. This one, yeah, about there. Lip depth, the lip step, about there. Okay, you know what? This could probably look like a new Sadie as well. <laughs> Same head, but it could, she could, you can create Sadie as well. But again, Alison or down. I think Alison looks a lot better than Sadie. I can't, I don't know really. Guys, let me know who's look better looking, Alison or Sadie. So that's a tough one. Uh, jaw and chin weak, towards narrow and slightly high. Jaw depth deep, chin shape tilted up towards high in the corner and narrow. Chin depth slightly towards deep. Uh, ears neutral, don't really need to go on there. Cheeks gone, up in the corner and slightly towards shallow. Teeth, chompers obviously, hair, I've chosen drop curl chignon and hair colour number one. So lifestyle, there's nothing there, nope, zero, healthy glow in the middle, nothing else. Tiredness, let me have a look at tiredness, just gonna put that down, so no tiredness, zero tiredness, make sure you guys get that. Uh, makeup, right. Now you can put a bit of a blusher on because Alison has, um, Alison has like pinkish cheeks. So, a bit of blusher on there. Eyeshadow, nope. Lipstick, eyeliner, that's it. Yeah, don't really need anything else. So, here you have it, guys. Alice in our doubt. Hope you guys like it. Very difficult to create. 
but chose the, the character that was the closest. So here it is. So this is the same head I used for Sadie Adler as well. So there you have it guys. Thanks for watching guys. I promised you it was going to be a female character.